Medications are widely available in several dosage forms, and most of it are available as solid. In fact, tablets are the most widely used. These are solid medications that are compacted into small form shapes. Tablets consist of several components. These components work together to ensure that the tablet is properly digested in the body, is easy to swallow, has flavorings or sweeteners for taste, and controls the time release of the drug to produce the desired effect. We'll be discussing coded and progressive tablets. Enteric coded oral tablets have a coating that protects the tablet from stomach acid and protects the lining of the gastrointestinal tract from irritation by the drug. Enteric coding is also a typically used in making sustained release tablets. On the other hand, Effervescent tablets are dissolved into a liquid before administration. These tablets contain special ingredients that release the active chemical ingredient by bubbling and fizzing once placed in a liquid. Effervescent tablets have the advantage of being completely dissolved in the liquid before the patient takes the medication. This allows for quicker absorption in the body than a solid tablet. Drug administration is the giving of a drug by one of several routes. Typically, the drug is introduced into the body far from the site. The drug must move into the bloodstream and be transported to the target sites where the drug is needed. Some drugs are chemically altered by the body before they perform the actions, and others are not metabolized at all. The final step is the removal of the drug and its metabolites from the body. Because the oral mode is the most convenient and usually the safest and least expensive, it is the most often used. When a drug is taken orally, food and other drugs in the digestive tract may affect how much and how fast the drug is absorbed. Thus, some drugs should be taken on an empty stomach, others should be taken with food, and others should not be taken with other drugs. Some of the advantages are as follows. Solid medications usually have a longer shelf life before expiring. Solid medications are easier to package, distribute, ship, and store. The dosing is more accurate with solid dosage forms. The solid dosage forms have been created to release the medication over a longer period of time in the patient's body. However, the disadvantages include some patients may have difficulty swallowing large tablets or capsules. Solid medications are not an appropriate choice for patients who are unconscious or have nasal or mouth breathing tubes for ventilation. Solid medications take longer to be absorbed, broken down, and distributed in the body. The stomach has to metabolize the medication before it can take effect. Solid medications are not fast enough for immediate action treatment. When immediate action treatments are required, liquids or injectable medications are more appropriate. Drug dosage forms are classified according to their physical state and chemical composition. Drugs can be administered by several different routes. And although the oral route is most common, it may not always be the most convenient or practical. 